Hey, what's up guys? It's Haydos here. And in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get this Rocket League. So Rocket League is pretty much just an overview of the game. So I'll talk to you. Like, But it pretty much costs $20 and you pretty much customize cars. You play soccer. It's just like... It's just like in space or something or other. But it's just an overall really fun game. So if you want to get it for free, because I know a lot of people might not be able to get it because they can't afford it or just they don't like spending money on games. But, yeah, I'm going to be showing you how to get it for free. So firstly, go in the description, click the game link, add fly, and you should come to, like, this mega site. Just click download through your browser. It should take half an hour to an hour for you to download it because uh, depending on your internet speed but once you've done that you should you should be you should once once that is done you go over to your downloads folder and it's right here exotic tutorials that's what you should do you click it once right click you will have to have win raft for this and you pretty much press extract to exotic tutorials rocket league thing so I did get this off someone. It's called Green Street Tutorials. I'll leave his link in the description. But, yeah, congrats to him. And then once you've extracted it, you should come to this folder right here. You want to double-click it, double-click it again, binaries, Win32, scroll all the way down until you find this Rocket League one. Right-click it and then press Run as Administrator. Now, I've already done that, and then once you've done as run as administrator, it should open up. Just click the game, and then right-click it and create a shortcut. Once you create a shortcut, just drag it onto your desktop, just as I have, so then it's easy to get to. Now, once you've done that, it should be able to load up. So just double-click it. It should pop up with this, like, thing, yeah, normal. Just press OK. Then it should come up with this little symbol down the bottom on your taskbar, and then it should start to load once it like loads. Okay, so pretty much I'll click it. Hey guys, um, what I'm trying to do right now is because it didn't work on my screen recorder, I'm still going to prove it. So pretty much what I said for you to do was to click on this after you've run it, click on the shortcut, then it should bring up this and then this is what happened and when I clicked on this it started working and everything but for my screen recorder it didn't allow it and it went all white but as I'm going to see show you this does work I'll quickly turn this up but yeah so it does work um sorry about my screen recorder that's not my fault I'm working on trying to get like OBS to work all my but as you can see you can play online exhibition. I'm gonna just show you that it does work on one. Just create a match. I'm gonna quickly turn it down again. So as I said, this does work. And then for blue. So yeah, this is just a quick little clip showing you like that my screen record didn't capture it, but it works and everything. My guys moving I I don't really I'm not really good at this game. I'm trying to do it one-hander. Oh, oh. Nah, I missed it. But anyways, guys, so yeah. So you can exit the match and everything. So yeah, everything works. It's, this is just a quick little video showing you that I'm not like trying to fake it or anything. But yeah, this does work. And in order to get out, you just press the leave game. But yeah, that's the end of the video, guys. I hope you liked it and enjoyed. See you on my next video.